Well, if it happened to slip your mind, clocks move forward an hour on Sunday morning for daylight saving time. While most of the state is on Eastern time, that isn't the case for some Hoosiers. News 18's Brad Oppenheim went to Pulaski and Stark counties to see what life is like planning around two time zones. Our whole life is disrupted because of the way this time is. It's been nearly half a decade since the whole state has been on one time zone. You're an hour early or an hour late. You, you never know. The Pulaski County town of Madaryville sits just miles south of the central time zone boundary. While Madaryville observes Eastern time, some nearby communities are an hour behind, making life that much more difficult. Madaryville post office clerk Kelly Rhodes works in one time zone but lives in another. I have to think, okay, I work. My hours are 7 to 2.30, but on my time, that's 6 to 1.30. So you constantly have to stop and think, okay, where am I at and what time is it? Right up the road in Stark County, the town of Sam Pierre is an hour behind. The time change has even taken a toll on business for some. Sometimes clients get upset because of our hours, you know, because we are in central time and they're on Easter time, and they get upset that they have to leave their homes a lot more earlier than what their appointment is scheduled for. Pulaski and Stark counties are two of Indiana's 12 counties that remain on central time. Reporting from Pulaski and Stark counties, Brad Oppenheim, News 18. Yeah, and daylight saving time starts Sunday at 2 a.m., so set your clocks forward an hour before you go to bed on Saturday night.